include everything. All right, guys. By popular demand, I finally got around to learning some Node, uh, Node.js, and we are going to start building out some of these API projects, starting with the timestamp microservice. Now, I'm not. I'm going to just be using my local version to showcase this. So, uh, if you want to follow along and use the exact same tools, uh, I'll go over that. That's what the point of this video is. Kind of a part zero or introduction. First thing you're going to have to do is install Node. You can just go the, to nodejs.org, download the version, and install. There's no tricks. There's no gotchas. You literally just install, and you're good to go. The next thing that I'm going to use for an editor is Visual Studio Code. This will be the text editor I'm using. So if you really want to follow along to the T, that's the text editor. And one of the resources I'll be using as well is Postman. You can download Postman by just typing in Postman Chrome and it will take you to the page. You get to the web store. It's, it treats it as a Chrome extension. And then basically this will be used to send uh, send uh, URLs and test things, but uh, don't worry too much about that right now. But those are the few things that you're gonna need to get started. And most importantly of all, uh, you're gonna need to have your essential oil diffuser going at all times to keep you on track. Uh, but no, that's all we're gonna need to get our project started. Uh, let's go ahead and jump into the first one, the timestamp microservice. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. If you're interested in coding bootcamp check out devmountain.com where housing is included in your price of tuition and don't forget to like comment subscribe and share and support me on patreon i'll see you guys in the next video thanks for watching